Team Grind, hi you living? It's a kid, Dre the Kid, and I'm back with another NBA video. I ain't did this in a while. You find my channel the first time, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share all your social medias. Follow me on my Instagram, at Dre the Widow 2.0. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you want me to see. You see me? I react, do action videos. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you see. React, you know, react to next. Sorry. And shut. And also support my Patreon. You know, link in the description below. And shout out to all the. Shaolin ninjas out there. Um, when I first heard this news about the Houston Rockets getting Russell Westbrook, the first thing I wanted to do was this. Oh, oh my gosh. I wanted to ram my head into the nearest hard, hardest object I can find and knock myself on contract because I felt like this is stupid. Let's talk about let's talk about this. You got two premier ball hogs on the same team. You got two guys who need the ball in their hand to create a play. You got you got two you got two guys who basically paying for stats. James Harden was playing for stat last, stats last season. Russell Westbrook been playing for stats all been playing. That's for long as we can remember. Averaging triple doubles a game. What y'all gonna do? Y'all gonna kick people out the pain and say, nah, we we nah, we gonna do this. Nah, I'm gonna do this. No, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. There's only one ball. What he do? Be willing to pass it and share and share it. And not only that, Russell Westbrook didn't even look good. Look good last year. Matter of fact, he ain't look good in the last two, three seasons. The guy has been constantly getting eliminated first rounds. Constantly. And he ain't look good last season. I um I think he was like what, uh only like sixty two percent from the fr from the free throw line, twenty less than twenty five percent behind a behind a three point line. Why would the Rockets want to pick that up? That was my that was my initial thought to this video, to what well, well, was going to be this video yesterday. That was my initial thoughts, but I thought thinking about the pros and what could the pros can be. Well, pro well here go one of the pros. James Harden and Russell Woodbrook are best friends. They know how each other play. They had been they had been to an NBA Finals together. Credit that was the one time when James Harden was only a six man. But you know James Harden has evolved into a superstar now. And secondly, we got rid of Chris Paul contract. Once again, I came up here and said 135 million dollars was stupid, and I kind of proven it to be right. Not always, but sometimes, you know, you know, DeAndre knows what he's talking about. Not all the time, but he, he knows what he's talking about sometimes. And what else what is good? What else good play? Uh, Russell Woodbrook. Russell is an as injury prone as CP3. CP3, you always got to wonder, is he going to make it to the next game? Is he going to make it to that game? When is he going to go down again? You really don't have to worry about that with Russell Woodbrook. Who I think is a natural better point guard. Okay, I gave Chris Paul that he's a natural better point guard, but you know Russell is still an All Star level athlete. If these two can share can share the ball, and some changes can be made to the Houston Rockets, this can be a good thing. For example, James Harden got to change his style of play. That ISO ball, all they got, all they got to stop. Twenty seconds, fifteen seconds to make a to make a decision. Do you want to throw it up for a three, or you want? Them Look, you want to look for uh, Clint Capella, Alley Oop? All oh, they got to stop, man. You got to be willing to pass that ball around. Everybody got to touch the ball. No, don't just rely on the three three point thing or the pick of the wish. Let's get to Mike D'Antoni. Mike D'Antoni got to change his style of playing. Doctors live by three, dying by three mentality, or switch it up and just and switch it up and just go for a layup. No, do other things. No. Get you know, pass the ball around, make more cuts, you know, develop a mid range game, why don't you? That'll make that'll make people think think twice about the Rockets. Yeah, I feel like this can work. This can work depending on how the Rockets wanna play this. If Clint Capella is still there, you know, it's gonna be James Harden, PJ Tucker, Eric going to if he also stood there, Russell Westbrook, and 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 Clint Capella. But that's gonna be the starting five. Will there be more changes made to the to this rocket to this rocket team? I don't know. Hopefully for the better. 
to me, be honest with you, my overall thoughts for this, we we just got we just gotta see how it goes. It could be better, it could be worse. I'm hoping for I'm hoping for better. I hope due to the fact that Russell Westbrook is playing with his best friend. And the fact that these two, uh, the Rockets can change up their style. James Harden can change up his style as well. But well, let me get oh, let me get back on the James Harden style for style of play for a second. He say people are hating on him for his style of play. Bruh, you have no rings. How many times did you give the Rockets to the hilltop? You got us to the hilltop, which is the Western Conference Finals. How many times you gonna get us to the hilltop, but not the mountaintop? We can see the mountaintop. But we can't get there. How many times you let us see the mountaintop and not get us there, man? Come on now. The ISO ball don't work. Uh, Kobe Bryant told you it didn't work, man. It don't work. Change the style up. Y'all playing like I said. Y'all playing like the Warriors did before they got we got before they got Kevin Durant. That style of play don't work no more. Change it up if y'all want to be champions. Oh, well, that's it. If y'all just want to get my clear thoughts, leave a, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share and share all your social media. Remember, every season's grind. Season underground takeover, man. Let's get it.